Hello and welcome to another reading from the book That I May Know Him, a Daily Devotional. Today's reading is entitled Teaching in Depth, February 14th. The officers answered, Never man spake like this man. John 7:46. Of Christ's teaching, it is said, the common people heard him gladly. Mark 12, 37. Never man spake like this man, declared the officers who were sent to take him. His words comforted, strengthened, and blessed those who were hungering for that peace which he alone could give. Oh, how tender and forbearing was Christ! How filled with pity and tenderness were his lessons to the poor, the afflicted, and the oppressed! His illustrations were taken from the things of daily life and had in them a wonderful depth of meaning. The fowls of the air, the lilies of the field, the seed, the shepherd, and the sheep, with these objects, Christ illustrated immortal truth, and ever afterward, when his hearers chanced to see these things of nature, they recalled his words. Christ's words, so comforting and cheering to those that listened to them, are for us today. As a faithful shepherd knows and cares for his sheep, so Christ cares for his children. He knows the trials and difficulties surrounding each one. He shall feed his flock like a shepherd, declares Isaiah. He shall gather the lambs with his arms and carry them in his bosom. Christ knows his sheep intimately, and the suffering and helpless are objects of his special care. Christ has weighed every human affliction every human sorrow. He bears the weight of the yoke for every soul that yokes up with him. He knows the sorrows which we feel to the depth of our being and which we cannot express. If no human heart is aroused to sympathy for us, we need not feel that we are without sympathy. Christ knows and he says, Look unto me and live. Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Matthew 11.28 I have borne your griefs and carried your sorrows. You have the deepest, richest sympathy in the tender, pitying love of your shepherd. His humanity is not lost in the exalted character of his omnipotence. He is ever longing to pour out his sympathy and love upon those whom he has chosen and who will respond to his invitation. Thank you for listening today. Be sure to join me tomorrow for another reading from the book that I may know him. Be encouraged.